roses are red Violets are blue Not suitable for most advertisers Confirmed by manual review Yeah Sorry I'm covering for a friend and I really don't know what I'm doing but uh, we're all paid under the table anyway so it's really not an issue right <laughs> not an issue for you at least but um, welcome to the washed up grocery barn I think that's what they taught me to say but washed up just like yours truly because a lot of the items in the store are used just like me because we had a security guard but he ran off with uh, one of the regulars here which uh, we'll get into I mean you're in this part of the area so what do you expect <laughs> but let's get right into it um, stick a gum I took it from the um, rack right there Go ahead and set your groceries right there, okay? Thank you. Yeah, just move the bags over. We don't have a bag rack. Here, I'll help you. You chew like a horse whenever you do end up having gum, so. But let's start. Hmm. Barilla Angel Air Pasta A. That's for pretentious people. Literally, pretentious people who all think that. Don't get me wrong. even work so I have to manually type everything in and I'm not sure if everything is taxable I know the gum's not but Snack packs, don't you usually get four? Why are you here? 
here anyway. There's like, there's no commons around here. Like, there's no projects. There's nothing. Really? Yeah, I know they like placed us outside of the bad part of town. And literally, I've been on section eight for years, but the people that walk in here are worse than the way that I used to act. Trust me. This guy is laughing because the government shut down, took people off of welfare, and they couldn't get their food stamps anymore, and I'm over here like, I know it's so funny that at one point in life, your parents never picked you up again, and you had to go out and fend for yourself, and you were too much of a, to ask for help, so you put down other people who are literally broken to the core and have to ask for help, and now they can't get their food. I know, it's not funny. So please, sweetie, don't think that I'm, you know, commenting on Section 8. I'm just saying I am actually kind of part of that stigma that they put on it. But, um, what are you gonna... Okay. Are you sure you want this? Peanut butter. Do you notice anything about the peanut butter? No. marshmallow fluff and peanut butter and banana slices on a sandwich. concern. It's not getting out of here or, you know, going home and, you know, having my mom scream in my face because literally they cut off my welfare because I was taking advantage and like, whatever. I know. You know, one time these people were like, you're the reason that other people can't get help. And I was like, I was the other. In fact, when I put my taxes on this year, not this job because obviously under the table, but, you know, being an escort, um, definitely is taxable income apparently legalized, um, and 
I got my, like, form back, I was, like, penalized for that stuff, you know what I mean? What is this? Kiko Men traditionally brewed soy sauce. I hope shaking it up doesn't mess up the concentrate. Concentrate? What is it? I don't know, I dropped out of high school when I was, like, 17. still have some of it or like okay 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 i'm sorry i talk too much i know we've been here for like 12 minutes so i'll just i'm hurrying up but thank you for staying and listening to me sauce on it you're wearing. Just dump it in there. Snip it up and you've got yourself a meal, sweetheart. A bunch of pepper. Tons of pepper. You want to make it a little bit spicy. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh. so. so anyway, with that being said, you were buying this or no? The cloverleaf beef cubes. That's another thing you can have. Um, usually, like, they won't let you get in with things with lids. It depends all on what jail you're in. You know, there's the jails that, like, allow you to have X box if you're serving life in prison. And, like, you can carpet your cells and everything like that. Like, please. And then there's jails like I was in where, you know, one of my boyfriends would come up and then they put their hoodie up and you put your hands like you're saying goodbye but you're not allowed to touch anybody unless it's a conjugal visit and that you have to be like super good as much as I gag I like to smell it as much as I like to smell my fingers after I smell this what about you well that 
those are just the things we don't talk about, you know what I mean? Like, we should be more open about the weird stuff that goes on. But like I said, nobody has time for snowflake bolt around here. So do you want these or not? Well, what I'm pretty sure is what happened is the lunchroom back there, which is basically like, we leave it open for anybody, you know, who's hungry. It's kind of like we take all the owners because he lives super far away from where we are and he just assumes that everybody is like doing their job like i'm gonna get her paycheck and if she doesn't give me her paycheck like i'm gonna jump on her whenever she's in a back alley somewhere or i'm gonna run up on her house things like that so yeah i'll only charge you like Shall we get ready to bag all your stuff? And then we'll go ahead and check you out. Yeah, I know we use other stores' bags. We can't afford like regular paper bags or like plastic bags. Like the elderly rarely come in here and whenever they do, they're You are in the bag. Okay. Let's get you set back up here. We only have like tenders of ten for some reason. And I think it's because um our dealer, the com the dealer of the groceries who comes in and everything. He always has like multiples of ten. See you soon. <laughs> Probably not.